So, spit it out. Where are we going? Pelt whale. Great. 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 I'm on it. Oh. One step forward, two steps back. Story of my life. Amazing. Just well and truly amazing. And while Laszlo and his little group ran off like this for the entire way, I, the narrator and guide of Laszlo, will talk. I'm on it. Because I have something to say. Something that actually affects you, Rang. <sighs> Some, something that actually affects the publishing of my videos. The gist of it is, I will take. There. Mm. Only take me to a licensed cleric. <sighs> Oh, I feel so cool. Oh, uh, I'm having none of that. Uh. Spit it out. I'm on it. Seriously. Sorted. Uh, where was I? Yes. No! Guys! How stupid can you be? You rang. Sorted. Go on then. <sighs> I blend. Sorted. I want to take a little break from video. Doing videos. Because. I want to write. That's the thing I want to do. Hmm. And that actually has suffered a little titsy bitsy tiny bit. Meaning, I didn't write as much as I want to. Is upon you, and it's considered a powerful curse. That's why I told you before that I would go where you wish as long as you keep me from this accursed sun. I truly cannot bear its gaze. <laughs> what the? Ah, okay, that's not time. If you are going to live on the surface, you are going to have to get used to the sun. <laughs> the talk is utterly repulsive to me. I simply don't know if I'll ever feel home beneath this burning blaze. Yeah, maybe you don't. You won't. But you've got to deal with it. I believe there may be wisdom in your words, Rastro, but it burns me all the same. Perhaps I can grow to tolerate it. I need to be... I need not be so insufferably weak in any case. There we go. Boop, 
Did that bandit camp? Let's go to the bandit camp. Good. Right, what's this then? <coughs> ah, the anticipation of incoming murder of bandits and incoming scalps, which will grant us lots and lots of money. The fuck is this? No one. Oh, hello. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not getting past. Seriously? An identify spell. Hallelujah. Hmm, excuse me. Wait, what? You already can identify. Oh. As do you. Do you have any stronger healing? The recipient of the spell gets the benefits of the blessed spell. calls upon his god to grant him power for a short period when he does this his strength constitution and dexterity are all raised by one point for every three levels of the caster interesting flame blade caster causes a blazing ray of red hot this blade like ray is wielded as if it were a sword that the cast already knows how to use, hence the, there are no bonuses or penalties. If the caster successfully hits with the flame blade in melee combat, the, creators, the creature struck suffers 1d4 points of dash, slashing damage, plus an additional 1d2 plus 4 points of fire damage. However, it is not a magical weapon in the normal sense of the term. So creatures struck only by magical weapons are not harmed by it. Okay. Um. Huh. Anything here? No, no, no. Okay. Spit it out. But that's it. I'm on it. Still don't know what this <sighs> is. Casting spells isn't as easy as I make it look. I'm tired. Oh, shut it. There. I know this is a ruin of some sort. But. What's that? Ruin? I mean... Will there be an entrance? Somewhere? Is it just... Oh, hello! Oh, I'm going to work down out the side. some end on you! Death. Okay, okay. Yes, I see. My blade will cut you down to size. Oh, yeah. So 
zombies are nothing. And I hate those buggers. God damn it, guys. <laughs> the melee ones have a little bit of fun too. Still, though, what this ruin is supposed to was supposed to be. It's weird. Could be this this could be a living area, it could be storage. It could be used as a podium or forum? I don't know. Oy. That let the narrator talk again. Uh, as I said, I want to write a little bit more, which means by the time I do that, I will not publish any vi videos whatsoever. Currently planned is just a month, but could go on longer. So you have been warned over the course of 11 minutes and 40 seconds. Yes, I'm rounding up. It's fine. But yeah, it could go on longer. The reason is I will still record because I don't want A to forget what I've been doing here and in Stace and in Yumavari and so on and so forth. But also then uh, what then, then, then it's done. I have it, I have finished those things. Oops. And I can move on. I can publish the videos have then even more time. Uh, selfish reasoning, but there you go. I have even more time to write. And after all of those things are done. Go for the eyes, Boo! Go no. for the eyes! After all those things are done and published, I can just go on my merry way and jump into other stuff. Probably the one that money still more scopes and better be more money. So who is you are responsible for scopes? You already have a warhammer. Yeah, that's a situation. You rang. I want to ride because that's what I really want to do. Right, that's what's this then? The most fun for me. Stories are the most. Stories are basically the most fun for me. Stories are dope. Baldur's Gate, Dark Souls, Yumavari, Stasis. 
My blade will cut you down to size. But I also want to create my own stories. Oh, I'm gonna work out some angles a little you. bit Death. difficult if you're just recording. Even though this is a story of Laszlo and yeah. he's currently a little bit happy because look at the scalps I collect. <laughs> he has gold pieces in his eyes right now. So much money in here. He doesn't give a shit if it is right or wrong right now. <laughs> he has just two reasons. Money and Korean. <laughs> and he's growing from, from here to here. I think it will spring in a step at just being a, a happy dwarf. Go for the eyes, Boo! Go for the eyes! You could actually say he's trying to be I need eight. Oh, 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 the character of merging into one entity. <laughs> oh. This is bad. Oh boy. But yeah. Me creating stories is a little bit on the back burner for far too long. Sorted. Far too long. I start I've started one bigger story and currently I'm writing a short story for some people on the Discord server which I still have to continue writing which is a little bit odd because that, that is actually one of the because that short story is supposed to be a like one And that is a short story I will not read. I do not have a voice for that. And then I have started another bigger one so I can get rid of some ideas and oh boy. <coughs> Hear them all. Uh-huh. All with fiery deaths, preferably. Hmm? What do you want? Uh you killing stuff. No. Olsa? Yes, 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 yes. You ride. Oh boy. I could use a little bit. Yes, 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 yes. Uh, I need a Bless my hamster. Just shut up and help oh. Just uh, go for it. Konya is in trouble, I am in trouble, everybody is in trouble. Just kill them all! <laughs> Ow! <laughs> You're a queer fellow. Go on. Eat flaming! Come on, come on, come on, come on. What was this then? Jesus! Minsk, you are now basically impenetrable. 
Now you have no excuse to get hit anymore. Well, I... <laughs> Help. Medium shield plus one. Neither of us can really use. Awesome. Why do I have still this? It goes into the bank. It goes into the bank. Oh boy. That is a one up plus one, as is that one. Awesome. Uh. Yay, more magics. Glitter dust. Of course you like glitter dust. Why wouldn't you like glitter dust? Uh. Blindness. Of course you fail. Threes. Of course you like that one. Who knew? Right, what's this then? No. Nope. You nope. ran. Right, what's this then? Oi, oi, oi. <laughs> How are we doing on XP? <laughs> Level 5 is so close. Oi, 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 oi. Okay. Where was I? Ah, yes. Me creating my own stories. The last thing I mentioned, the second biggest story I'm currently on about. As I said, just to get some ideas out of the way and hopefully cool. Here in way. Why is this screw on my chair so loose? And why am I feeling with my chair, you ask? Those reasons. Anything else? No? We're good? We're good, I think. And another one. <sighs> Ooh, right, 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 right. Stuff. I forgot. It's a camp. A camp I'm liberating. M1. What do you want? I'm gone. Ooh. Go on, then. Sort it. Stuff. Oh. Hello. My blade will cut you down to size. Yes, yes. Ow. Ow. Jesus. Oh, Jalcales, Carlos, nah. Get out of the way. Seriously, woman. Spit it out. My blade will cut you down to size. This is just not going to work for you then. Ay, ay, ay. <sighs> I'm on it. You right. Bloody 
Damn it. Night Singer. <laughs> this is what happens if the narrator wants to talk. The narrator should shut up and let me do it all gang. Hello. See? Way more exciting. Hello. Mm. Fine. Hello. No. I don't care what, about what yep. Boo likes. The moment. I'm gone. We need the imp. We need the unbelievable dexterous fingers of M1. M1 the Great. What? Oh, come on, M1. You rang. Actually, right, what's this then? A thing that you can't open. Oh boy. We have to come back later then. M1. I care not. Yes, you do. I've done had enough of this. No, you don't. Don't forget, there's money in there. Your point, Squeaky Wheel, gets the kick! <laughs> You're a queer fellow. Yeah. I've Squeaky done had enough of this. Gets the fist. Go on, then. Who thinks you can't open? I'm oh, on boy. it. Uh, that's fine, I suppose. What do we have here? Even right, what's this then? Okay. Oh, oh. Yes, yes, yes. What do you want? I'm gone. Come on, everyone. I know you can do it. Yes. Okay. It's healing, so and what ring do we have here? The iron thorn. Cursed ring of slight monsterism. The iron thorn. This rocked iron band is pitted at Stained as if by acid. Between the two thorns formed by the band, a crude lump of silver on its head suggests the image of a skull amongst a black field. Perhaps a symbol of miracle, lot of bones. The crypt abilities changes the wearer's appearance to that of a zombie. Charisma minus four and may only be removed by remove curse spell. Okay. <laughs> that is Sorted. Mighty unfortunate. I'm on it. I thought Yeah new stuff because new RPGs don't really have cursed items. And then Suddenly build this gate. Yeah, eat shit. <laughs> Sorry, friend, but you've got a date down under. Okay. I don't care who you are, no one wants to enter that extent and the penalty of death. Uh who guys are in here? <laughs> don't come at me for I have no intention of turning back. 
We are here in the Dadox instructions. He requested that we retrieve his files and documents and deliver them to him as soon as possible. And no! I want your scalps! You are dead, little worm. Let's see. Is there is really true. no one else you can bother? Nope. Get what is it this the time? Mage now. Yep. I want him as dead as humanly possible. You right. Go for the eyes, Go for the eyes. I care not. I caramba. Touch someone else, you filthy swine. No, you're doing just fine. You rang? Yes, I rang. Go on then. Sure. Uh-huh. Uh dance exploding and blasting apparently. Eh? What do you want? Mage is still alive. <laughs> You're Which a queer a fellow. Problem. Spin it out. Um he's still Is there really alive. no one else you can bother? No. What is it this time? You rang. Yeah. Okay. Forward, Go for the eyes, boo. No. Go Hello. for the eyes. No. Oh. Ow. oh God. Uh, perception. Fortitude. Slaves thou. Slaves sell. You are fire breath. No. Fire breath. Awesome. No. Yeah. Drink. Go on then. Let's talk more fight. Touch someone else, you filthy swine. Oh, shut up, you like it. Spit it out. Okay. You this. You all of those. And this one. Identify spell fire resistance. Good, good, good. Identify the dead shot plus two. Longbow of marksmanship, the dead shot. Driven by years of rivalry, the Dukes of Spendalion and Dead Huntel decide to organize a private contest that would proclaim the better archer between them. Both boasted the power of their magical bows, but that wasn't enough for Eldwell Dest, Duke of Spendalion. He arranged for the theft of his opponent's bow, and on the day of the contest he couldn't help gloat in his advantage. The Duke of Del Tonto, known only as Raymond, demanded, demanded a demonstration of Eld Edward's skill on a scarecrow that he placed. Edward Dest drew his longbow and released the arrow with determination. Not stopping to think how uncannily t the target resembled himself. The missile split the large voodoo doll's head in twain, and at that moment, Edward's head did much the same. Oh dear. Not usable by thief. Oh, 
Oh, you are kidding me. You are <laughs> well and truly evil. I have a nice bow, but Imuel can't use it. Not usable by cleric, druid, mage, monk, shaman, thief, cleric, ranger, factor, druid, factor, cleric, factor, magic, mage, cleric, cancer, and cavalier. And of course a wizard's there because... No, I, I can! Why not a long ball? Oh, you are evil. Such is life, I suppose. <sighs> you rang. Right, what's this then? <laughs> this is just not fair. Inventory is full, what? Oh. God damn it. I'm not shooting the arrows fast enough. Still not cool. So absolutely and utterly not cool. Come on. Why can't... Oh, no, wait. The story. The bow was stolen and then... Yeah, okay. I get it. I get it. No! Go on, then. Uh, you have to either rest outside, Sorted. which means... Let's talk to... No! Troubled times are upon us. And aside. It's time, then, is it? Uh, explain yourself? Execution, what do you think? You are not with him, are you though? No, I'd smell his rancid breath on you if you were. Yes, we are not Tazog's lackeys. What's going on here? Aye, you are not. Well, this place is dirty to the core, that's what's going on. These aren't your ordinary bandits. They're part black talons and part chill being a demi-human band, mostly hobgoblins, and led by the creepy smart one out in a crush. Already killed him! There'll be others elsewhere, like that priest Mullahay, sent to poison the minds of Nashkel. Already dead. Set himself up as a kobold god returned, and the legion of the brainless barking fools believed him. Ready to do his bidding till Death do they part. Well... Mulla is dead. He was working for Tezok, I understand. Question is, who is Tezok working for? Good question. That's a trick, see? Crush and Torgos Gozan, leader of the Black Talons, both think he's getting orders from the Zens. And Tezok doesn't do much to discourage that particular line of thinking. But the Black Tons and Chill and Chill are bandit groups, see? They ply the trade roads, avoid the cities, and that's where they go wrong. I'm from the gate. I can tell you that as leather that the Tantarim aren't behind this. How can you be so sure? A desire for silence isn't the only reason I wear I wear soft soled boots. I wear them so I can tell whose toes I'm treading on. I didn't mess with no Zentarim. I picked my enemies and I messed with one group and one group only. The Iron Throne. Dragged as rain, here I am as Tadok's personal prisoner. You do the math. Um, the bounty notices also mentioned the Iron Throne. Okay, now, how many will go on? Oh, Game of Thrones! This will be fun. 
When did the original Baldur's Gate come out? I think way before King George R. R. Martin's books, even. So, but yeah, another question, where can I find them? Kazak's been making regular visits to the Cloakwood, so that's where I'd start if I were you. There are some documents in that chest that might be worth looking at, too. Now go step on some toes, alright? And you can tell them, and the size sent you. Of course it's trapped. Oh, of course it's trapped, and of course what do you want? it's a goddamn cloak, what? Yes. Malahe and Tezak have proven uh. to be nothing more than puppets. The true master of this unfolding mystery continues to elude you. One thing is certain. Someone has taken a very personal interest in seeking your death. Though why, you are not sure. Your search for answers continues, and the foreboding Cloakwood Forest is your next target. Good. But can I please loot first? Oh. Now, Nartha. Come on, Spit it out. I'm on it. No. Oh. Yes, yes, we are resting. See, everything's a okay. Right, what's this then? I'm on it. <sighs> and wait, we got money from that. Money, sweet, sweet money. We should we lose because cloakwood spiders poison more money, which we will not keep. Identify Legacy of the Masters. Ooh. Gauntlets of weapon expertise, Legacy of the Masters. Highly soaked after among novice warriors. These items were once a property of the royal family of Thraskel. Imparting a portion of the prince's legendary skill, these gauntlets grant bearer mastery over all forms of weapons. The majority of their many previous owners seem to have come to Bloody ends, though. The gloves grant the ability of experience, but not the wisdom. Not usable by Wither's Lair and can't say off. <sighs> Fine. God damn it all. <sighs> what do we have here? Letter. Tazok. I hope that everything moves along smoothly. I have written to give you instructions from our superiors. Go fuck yourself. I have been told that a small band of mercenaries might cause the Iron Throne some trouble in the future. Yeah, guess what? You are to ensure that they don't live to upset our operations. Obtain the services of the assassin Nimble. He should serve you well. <sighs> Number two. Tazok, I have noticed that your shipments of iron have slowed of late. 
It is imperative that we receive another ton of ore. Another ton! Step up your rates and get shipments to our base in Cloakwood within the next week. We need to stock by as much ore as possible before ultimatum is given. Os Saravok wants to know what has happened with a band of mercenaries. Have they been killed? You'd better ensure that they have been, as Saravok will not take kindly to any other news. The warm. Before I do that... Yep, they're in. Oops. Which means... Ah... Christ's sake. Drink. We rang. Right, what's this then? Cloakwood. Of course, it's goddamn Cloakwood. Why well, it wouldn't it be Cloakwood? Uh, let's explore the rest of this bandit camp. Maybe we can eke out another level. And loot. Person for almost all of you. And now. Okay. Nope. Yes. Nope. If you say look off. Yep. M1. This way. Oh yes, I'm slightly beef right now. Go on, I'm on it. I care not. Yes you do. I've done had enough of this. See. Money. Spit it out. I'm on it. <gasps> Nothing. The spell. Shar looks upon us with favor. I oh, shut it. Damn it! A potion. <laughs> You're a queer fellow. Yes, I'm. I'm queer. gone. Whatever. I'm going to that. The sweet money will not. Be in our possession for much longer. Oh, it's you so rang. much pain. I'm on it. So much pain. You be quiet. Uh. Tursus. Who was literally. I'm on nothing. it. Ball plate and packing steel. Go on then, I'm on it. You point ball plate and packing steel. Yes. You do. <laughs> it hurts. Really? What you want? <laughs> hurts. To get all this money. I've done had enough of this. And then, really? To get all this money. And Spit it out. Right, what's this that you will spend it up on Sorted. and it out. Get over here! I mean, I just know it's... 
What can they do? What Let's can talk they... more fight. Yep. Uh, what can they do? It's just yeah, you could just roll over and die. <laughs> <sighs> you rang. I'm on it. Before. Let's distribute a lot of stuff. God damn it all. So much stuff. What are you? Fire burning. Okay. One point I need someone on designated potion carry duty. <laughs> that of course. Go on then. Sort it. Right, what's this then? <laughs> You're a locked. queer fellow. I'm gone. Why wouldn't it be locked? You rang. Right, what's this then? Uh... Right, what's this then? Damn the game. I just want to be rich. What's so wrong about that? Now you have to go to these areas and to actually survive them, you have to pay a lot of money. I'm on it. Oh, nobody here. Thank the gods. Money gods. <sighs> cruel, cruel world. Of course. What you want? Why do I even bother? This way. Just go directly in with good old in one. I'm on it. I'm just grumpy that the man. Right, what's this then? Oh, oh, the way. We had almost 8,200. Oh. It hurts. The pain is real. This is evil. This is just evil. I never asked for this. <sighs> I just want money. I want to go back to Candle Keep. I mean, what's so wrong with just living my life as I see fit? When I would have left on my own accord, but no. There's this nasty thing called fate, apparently. And fate decided, nope, you <laughs> are very, very important and therefore a target for a lot of assassins. And they know where you live, so you better get the fuck out. Or rather, you shouldn't have been born, maybe. I don't know and I don't care. You are in deep shit. The wheels of fortune do not favor you in... What? Do not favor you one bit, so... Get your ass out of here. I want to read my books. Thank you very much. 
Turn out a smelly dwarf in here. That's probably how fate, fate sounds. I mean, come on! I know that I'm not the most lovable person, but at least I have agency. I just want to have money and have a bakery where I can't do stand-up comedy. Yes, it's a comedian bakery. Deal with it. I want it. We will have comedy, slapstick, satire. We have it all. And it will be lovely. I mean, who wouldn't like that, huh? Having baked goods and a, and a good love, and maybe even some political commentary. Good end, on the good end, on the bad, on the gods, and on everything. Come on. Who wouldn't laugh that, eh? This is just me. This is beyond evil. Oh, oh, hello. Hmm. You come to mock Garalax, Garalax's clan. In cave for long enough, let us out now or die. Let all the filthy gnolls to let them do evil. Boo's blood boiled at the hall. Minsk smells righteous butt kicking coming. Uh, and many other foul smells too. Yes, but it was very stupid of the bandits to lock the whole clan of gnolls in such a small cave for so, so long. Uh, uh, are you here anyway? We're in here because of trouble we caused in camp. Big wall two nights back. You should know that, unless you're not black talent. You not smell right, you die. <laughs> Oh god! That is quite a mess. Come on, Let's See, even those, two, those three are just. My blade will cut you down to size. I continue with this, I'll never look you in the eyes again. Choose carefully. I'll not let this come to pass. What are you even on about? Uh, right, what's this then? Apparently just... Long Go for the eyes, Minsk Boo! Ranting. Go for the eyes! Rask! We're doing enough good to keep you happy. Letter, why does a chair have arms and legs but a hand like a man but cannot walk or fold things? Okay, I have to say this joke will not be in my bakery. No, it won't. It's not even funny. It's not even funny. 